what is best in life. Uh, today we join Sultan Barad, the younger brother of the uh, a tragically slain uh, Sultan Alandin. Sultan Alandin had magnificent stats compared to Sultan Barad and the rest of his family, his older brother, uh, so much that I uh, suspect he was probably cuckolded. Uh, let's just get the uh, game playing and we'll... All right, we have a victory in the war for Azerbaijan, where my 1,600 troops were able to defeat a larger force from the Adwid Emirate. Uh, we are currently, uh, the Sultan Barad takes over in the middle of a, of a war for the uh, Sheikdom of Shirvan and the Azerbaijan, uh, in the Azerbaijan Duchy. And that is all part of the uh, de jure duchies that form the satrapy of Moose Jaws. Uh, Moose Jaws, where I am the Sultan of. It's this uh, sheikdom right here. There's a war going on for it. Uh, I had a council set up. I had uh, I made some magnificent jewels. If you look in my treasury, I had a Staff of Majesty, which gives plus 0.5 prestige monthly, plus 3 feudal vassal opinion, plus 2 city vassal opinion, as well as a heavenly circlet, circlet plus 3 feudal vassal opinion, plus 2 city vassal opinion. And then uh, the ceremonial robes uh, were granted me by uh, an emissary from the emperor. I think I had some grace with the Tang Empire. I still maintained my grace by uh, turning in a wanted fugitive. I gained 300 grace, so can I ask for a boon? Uh, there appear to be no boons that I could request. I do not have a Chinese, request Chinese artifact. I need 500 grace, request siege engineers, 750 grace. Strategist, they don't really need yet. Scholar bureaucrat, 1,000 grace. And I could send an artifact. I won't be sending one of my powerful artifacts, though, to uh, China unless I win one in war and can't otherwise use it. Uh, so I guess we will begin the war. I have more titles. I've entitled my uh, my stewardship skill is so much less than my brother's that I am unable to maintain the same number of holdings. So I will be getting rid of some of these Varams. Yeah, it's the Varams that... Uh, uh, I understand the Varams are the temples, so I guess it, I shouldn't have been holding them anyway. But uh, let me see, I will begin with that if I can. And I will search the realm for men of my religion, my culture. Uh, ru uh, let's see here. Search the realm adults, yes, and see if they're suitable for Varams. Uh, oh, here's a Mobad of Hermuz, who's actually quick. Um, he's ill, but that's all right. I will try to see if I can... Can I invite him to court? No. So, diplomatic range, yes. Uh, do I need these guys to join court, or will they join it even without... Um, here, severely injured... I guess I'll have to search my vassals for the... This is Farzad, a courtier, heir to the Walia. He's already an heir. He's a mayor. Herbad, courtier. Might be... He doesn't have much learning. Um... Is there a... Uh, let's see here. Join court. Yes. Oh, he has no learning whatsoever. So we'll hit no. And I guess what we can do is we'll just search my court. Oh, here's a genius, but he's already mayor. Here's a courtier. He's possessed. This man has cancer. Uh, he's already her bad. I will, I'll try just going to the holding. Varam. Here's the victory. This battle has shown my true metal. I am brave. 
Oh, I didn't want you to be out fighting battles anyway, although it's great that you've gained the brave trait. Uh, Barad, my brother, yay, good for you. We'll replace you. And then show the commanders. Uh, the court physician, no. The Wally, no. The mayor, the old wound has finally healed. That's terrific. Uh, oh, they have terrible statistics. The Herbad. So let me just see how this war is progressing. Yes, I'm sieging down. Uh, that has too many troops for me to assault, so I will have to siege them out. Hopefully they won't come. Now, he has a message about appoint commander. So I will choose an ambition, become a paragon of virtue, exalted, acquire a title, groom an heir. I will acquire a title. And position of commander. I'll accept the position of commander. I'm noticing he's, I'm too stupid for him to make me my grand vizier. So what skill will I pursue? Actually, I will, uh, I really should, it's either a matter of doing the business trait all over again to try to uh, increase my business um, and stewardship function or my uh, intrigue trait and what societies can I uh, apply to join hermetic society assassins I don't think I'll be joining the assassins again I think that was a bad mistake um, so what can I really do uh, I will try theology learning plus two health plus one scholarship Uh, I'll just pause one moment. Uh, life has intruded, and I'll be right back. And I have returned back from uh, a brief interruption of my real life, and I will take the scholarship focus and try to increase my learning, although it's my abysmal, it's one of my worst stats. I will try to uh, do that. Now I have open council positions. Oh, and I have to keep an eye on this war that's going on. Uh-oh, who are these troops? Orthodox Uprising. Army of Bakhtarir. Who are they, and why are they interrupting? Hopefully they'll just walk away. I have 80% war score against Sultan Abdullah. He won't accept my war demands yet. And I'll try to appoint my council. I do need a spy master always. Uh, I have a spy master that the mayor of Zhejiang. He's got a 19. Well, oh, hopefully I'll have to bribe him, send him a gift. There, that puts him positive. I'll get him steaming. And my Mobad uh, with the 17 learning, Farzad. And then I'll do a quick check on the religions of the area. They're looking good in Zoroastrian. I think, is this Manichaean? Uh, yes, Gurgan is still Manichaean, so I will proselytize in Gurgan. Now this army could crush me if it uh, feels like it, but it's not, but it's just, there's the army of the Sultanate, and there's the army of this Orthodox uprising now I'm I have 96% war score they still won't accept my demands to surrender siege of Baku he's sieging down what I've sieged I'm hopefully he'll just leave afterwards no character and so I have a council established now I need now the Varam, here we go, where's the Varam? Walia, the Varam, 
and I will just create a new vassal. And there we go. That's taken care of one. Idle council. My spy master should be scheming. ABS always be scheming to protect my life. And uh, collect taxes in Gurgan. Be collecting taxes in Gurgan. I've won a victory. Darn it, I had 100% war score for a second. Then it dropped back down to 90. And he won't surrender. Now, Walia. There's another Varam. And it's in Kazwin. And I'll just create a new vassal. There we go. So now I'm down to eight holdings. And I have a 94% war score. Will he accept peace? No, he wants 100%. And this Orthodox uprising is just continuing. And who are they? They're the army of the Sheikh Yahya. 5% every 12 days. They're going to take a while. So I still have two holdings left. Who is my heir? My nephew. Uh, I will give him the Walia of Ahar to my nephew. So that's got me down to seven titles. And who is attacking? in Azerbaijan. Don't attack me. I have no quarrel with you, Mr. Orthodox, Orthodox Uprising guy. On January 8th, he'll arrive, and I will arrive in Sharemka on January 8th. Now he's going to Civic. I have bad news from Gurgan. My efforts to squeeze some extra taxes have caused resistance. That's okay. So... All right, my allies are, are here. Now, can we take on... My allied army from the Kazakh has shown up. Now, I have a... Sh I need to get rid of one Sheikdom. What is this Talyesh? Galan? is a, a wrong holding type. This has somehow become the temple. And so this is Galan. I hate my life. I've become depressed. Open council positions. Grand Vizier. And I will get scheming on de jure duchies. I've got diarrhea. Don't tell me I'm going to Emir Nizam. Not this Emir. I have a Chinese court physician. Why do I keep getting this Ir Emir's Nizam the fat? Court Iman of the Abbasid Empire. Oh, I want to go to my own, uh, to my own uh, physician. He ordered that the foul smells of civilization make me ill and I walk in the wilderness plus one health effect. So it's Kurdistan where I want to develop. Kurdistan where I want to fabricate a claim. Although he's been reabsorbed into the Abbasid Empire. So he has only has 900, the Emir of Mosul. Okay, so now it's been reabsorbed into the empire. So let me see here. But he still looks like a worthwhile uh, 
opponent to attack, although not as useful, although not as so much as before. I've contacted dysentery. Don't tell me this is my third count in a row that's going to go down. My court physician says to came to offer me several treatments for my illness. This option, let's try something new, I insist, from the brave trait. Oh, please, if only I could use my Chinese physician. Emer Nizam assistance assured you you were assured him you were asleep. However, Nizam's potion had failed to fully take effect. Even though you could neither speak nor move, you were still aware of everything they did to you. You tried to scream and thrash, but you were a prisoner in your own body. The procedure seemed to last forever. And I've gained a lunatic trait. If I didn't have bad luck, I'd have no luck at all with the last three emirs. Let's see here. How is my income? At least my income is still good in the positive uh, sphere. Uh, one child lacks a childhood focus. Rowdy, which is useless. I will try to get duty to go for conscientiousness. And she's a Persian and a Zoroastrian and a Jaws. So I will try to uh, Actually, we're going through them so badly, I'll try to go through a matrilineal marriage. Oh, no, I've taken a defeat. Oh, okay, it was just a defeat of a siege. I have 91% war score, 138 dis defenders. And I still have this orthodox uprising on my hands to deal with. I still have one sheikdom. I think it's the sheikdom of Galan. Yes. Galan that'll pass off to my family member, to my heir. And I will grant that sheikdom of Galan. There we go. And why do I have my spy master quit? Please, I need a spy master to keep me alive. Um... Alandon, Sheik of Galan. Uh, all right, I'll try to keep you alive. Scheme, victory, offer peace. There we go. I won the war before the battle took place. And I have acquired an extra Sheikdom. Uh, or is he, he's just my vassal. Shervan wants a seat on the council. Sheikh Karachak. I guess he only holds the one sheikdom. And he's an Orthodox Christian and an Armenian. Uh, well, we will revoke his title. And see how this goes. He humbly accepts the decision to be revoked of his title. And let me check what uh so now i hold the um so i hold it orthodox uprising bishopric of absharon and city of La of lankaran so let me see here my vassals bishop of ashkaran negative 29 he's got to be Okay, why can't I revoke Grant Light Land a title, revoke title? He has titles that cannot be revoked. Okay, so that's the bishop. Oh, because he's in rebellion, I suppose. And the city of Lankaran. And I'll get I'll set the speed to one. Now the mayor of Lankaran. And he is an Armenian Orthodox Christian. I will revoke his title, the city of Lankran. And yes, see if he opposes me. And my character, Sultan Barad, has died. I am now playing as Wali Elg. No, I'm now playing as, yes, the other Wali Elg of Musala in 
an inheritance or in a regency that's three or four sultans that have died in a row uh well this could be coming to the end of our and i'm trying to attack the orthodox bishop i guess this is the bishop here a message about he would like to give me salt in the land and he would like to appoint me spy master uh, let me see, Sultan Aladdin. Oh, I've just turned 16. I have a seduction focus. Acquire title. Except, was that a glitch? Am I alive again, somehow? I magically just came alive with the seduction focus, or this is a different Sultan? Bishop, okay, Mayor of Lankin. I will revoke his title. I don't have 25 prestige. I have to wait for prestige. Uh, open council positions. I will reappoint a council once again. My spy master. Oh, this guy has a fantastic stewardship. Um, Durek Pat, he has 12 stewardship. Thank you for your service, but I'm reappointing someone with a better stewardship than you. He hates me, but as long as he collects my taxes, tax shifted burger obligations law, and we will collect taxes in Gurgan, spy master, lustful, the mayor, and you will scheme, scheme your little heart out, and the Mobad for Zad. For some reason, he keeps resigning every time my uh, Sheikh dies and gets reappointed, and he will proselytize, keep proselytizing your little heart out and train troops in Gurgan, fabricate claims in Kurdistan. You keep going. Uh, minor titles, commanders. Uh, oh, the Bishop of Ashkaron is actually half decent as a commander. So I'll appoint him as a commander. And someone has 23 stewardship. Oh, that's the mayor of Lankaran. And yes, he does have I guess I could appoint... No, I won't appoint him as a commander. He'll just die uh, at the head of my armies. And I now have nine titles and only have the stewardship ability to take three. And I have the seduction focus and acquire title. Do I at least have a family? I have one child, my daughter, princess. Now I'll give her a focus of duty. And... I need a matrilineal marriage to try to keep my dynasty alive. Uh, do we have any young people with good statistics? Seven, five, strong. He's 50. And she, oh, she's only one years old. Five. Um... This would give me a non-aggression pact with the scourge of the Tengri. Uh, child of a concubine. Well, he's got a claim. He's got a claim on titles. I'll marry matrilineal him. So that set up my dynasty, maybe to save my dynasty from this uh, string of cancer. And now what titles do I have to dispense with? The uh, Walia. And do I have any family members? He's accepted my betrothal settlement. So I've gained one sheikdom, the sheikdom of Shirvan. Uh, I'm trying to develop a claim on another. I guess my income is still stable and is still pretty good uh, with a monthly balance of plus 16. I just unfortunately have to dispose of titles and I don't have living relatives to grant them to what male living relatives do I have? I have Elg, my cousin. Um, and this is me. There's another Elg, my other cousin. Heir to the Jaws, Shondam. Uh, Wally Elg of Musale. So I'll grant him the landed title. I'll grant him Galan. And the 
Qualia. Oh, I still have to give away two more titles because of my ridiculously low, uh, my ridiculously low stewardship score. So my heir, uh, which will I give away? What's Baku? Is this Baku here? Yeah, Baku, Shirvan. So I'll make my heir Sultan of Shirvan. Or Sheik of Shirvan. There we go. Open council positions. Oh no, my masterful steward left me. Well, he wanted a, a point on council, now we'll collect taxes. Go to Gagan and collect taxes. And I'm still holding one too many shakedoms. Uh, which is Margar. Yeah, this is a small one, Margara. And it's not a trading post or anything. So I'll grant my heir Margara. So my Demesne size is sufficient, and I have another open council position, my marshal this time. Um, not my court position, even though my court position it doesn't do anything for me. I keep having to go to the Abbasid court position, and I will appoint him, train troops in Gargan, I guess, why not? Sheikh Wanad, he's happy with me. At least the mayor seems unhappy with me. I'm a heretic. Oh, he's a Manichean. Can I demand a religious conversion? He won't accept it right now. Okay, so now I need to start making... Okay, I'll disband my forces. Reduce my levies. That gets my income plus 23 a month. Now I should be, Gurgan, I should be spending some money. I have a hospital. Can my trade post, fort level, trade value plus 50, trade root wealth plus two. All right, so we'll increase that. And Kazwin. Uh, rudimentary trade offices, technology spread rate, monthly prestige, retinue size, small mercenary garrison, trade value plus five, trade value of 80.51 combined from Kazwin, trade post cities, base value 10%, and we will, uh, I guess we'll go for a small mercenary garrison and this one and then in Tabriz we will look at the trade post and monthly prestige retinue size and we'll go for the 300% garrison size and the trade value increase what is the garrison size anyway it's pretty small it goes from 100 to 300 I suppose and the garrisons here or the levy garrison 260 Garrison 250, Garrison 493. Uh, so I'm spending money upgrading my trade posts. And in Gurgan, the hospital. Uh, I don't have enough money to upgrade my hospital anymore. Hopefully that will change. And yes, I've got to get seducing some women. Uh, search realm. Search all for women, uh, married, I guess unmarried ones, Diplo range, yes. Uh, my religion, my culture, any religion, uh, any culture, adult, yes. Um, and then let's get the geniuses. 
the population is uh there we go. We have one success this episode with the population of Gurgan has converted to Zoroastrianism thanks to our court vizier. And I will... And why cannot I seduce her? Is a vassal or below? My wife Hamdan is pregnant. Uh, all right. Well, we'll end this episode there. Uh, with my pregnant wife. It's uh, the 6th of July, 818. Another Sultan has died uh, to a horrible disease. He only lasted uh, one, about three or four years. His brother has ascended the throne. Another Sultan, Alandin II of the Jaws Shandam. I hope that uh, this Alandin, although he has terrible stats, uh, will be able to survive longer than the past three have. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, please hit the subscribe button and the bell so you get notifications of my new videos and have a nice day.